Morgan Hartman was born with physical and cognitive disabilities. For years though, she lacked a diagnosis. One thing she did have was a happy spirit. Her dad, Gordon Hartman, never wanted to see that spirit dulled, but unfortunately, at times it was. Uh, in 2006, we were on a family vacation where I uh, watched Morgan not be able to participate um, in a pool activity with some with three other children, and it was simply because she was not able to be verbal. It almost puts a lump in your throat because it, it gives you a very sad feeling that all Morgan wanted to do was to participate. Uh, she just wanted to play. After seeing his daughter excluded, Hartman started on a quest to create a space where no one felt left out. His idea, an inclusive theme park. He had experience as a builder and enlisted help from other experts to turn his dream into Morgan's Wonderland. Hartman says the San Antonio theme park isn't just for people with disabilities, it's for everyone. But he made sure every single experience and ride is what he calls ultra accessible. The park is believed to be the only one like it in the world. And it has expanded to include a sports center and a camp with an outdoor adventure park. And that's the beauty of this place, is that it's an opportunity for everyone to truly enjoy um, uh, playing together. But also, no matter what their condition may be, that's not a question anymore. Between all of Morgan's ventures, there's a Ferris wheel, zip lining, and even a water park. And for people who can't get their electric wheelchairs wet, don't worry, Hartman and his team thought of that. So we have a wheelchair valet. You go from your wheelchair to a wheelchair that's been specially built to the size that you need. And if you're in a, a battery operated wheelchair, we actually give you a pneumatic wheelchair, which works off compressed air, it works underwater. Hartman has seen firsthand how an accessible theme park can change lives through joy. I met a, a, a couple from Mexico City, and they had never had a chance to, because of their special need, ever a chance to play in water together. They heard about it, they came here, they cried with me and talked to me about how this was the most wonderful opportunity they had ever had. Morgan's Wonderland has welcomed visitors from dozens of countries and all 50 states, and those with disabilities enter for free. It's the small things that make the big difference, uh, having fun. And, you know, for too long, I think, um, individuals have had to watch and say, I wish I could. Here at Morgan's Wonderland and all the different Morgan's venues, uh, you don't watch, you participate. At nearly 29 years old, Morgan was finally diagnosed with tatton brown rayum syndrome, a rare genetic disease. A lifelong question answered. That same happy spirit, still there and shared with millions of other people who visit the theme park she inspired.